to another video on the Enchanted Basin. If you're new here, hi, I'm Jenny. It is so nice to meet you. I like to do videos that are Halloween or witchy oriented, vegan taste test, craft with me videos, and chronic illness awareness chats. Shout out to all my fellow spooky spoonies. And today's video, my friends, we are doing a massive Killstar haul. I bought, let me just grab the box. <laughs> I bought, you can't even see, I bought so much. Um, there were three different sales. So I'm gonna go over what I got in each of the sales and what I ended up paying for a lot of these. There was there was a 40% off four clearance items. So if you buy four more clearance items, everything was 40% off. There was the, they were like 30% off birthday sale, which was awesome because it pretty closely coincided with my birthday. So I also had some VIP points to use. So I got a whole bunch, I got an order from the US and I also got my first order from the UK store because they had a lot more in stock than the US store and their shipping, I don't know if maybe I just got super lucky, but it was super, super quick. Like literally within four days I had the package. And it was not a small one. <laughs> the third sale was the International Bat Night Sale. They did 30% off. So if you bought anything from like their bat collection, um, if you got anything else other than the bat collection, you also got 30% off that. So 30% off total order as long as you got some stuff from the bat collection, which you know I did. I did want to take a quick second before we get started to talk about Zimf. Zimf is an eyewear company and they reached out to me because they were like, hey, we were wondering if you would be interested in trying out some glasses from our site. And you guys know I love my fun glasses, whether it's sunglasses or reading glasses. I, I love some glasses that are really fun and quirky. So I checked out their website and they had some really awesome styles. They have stuff for men, women, just a lot of different designs. So depending on what you're into, you're probably gonna find something you like. Also, the prices are insanely good. I'm someone, even though I have vision insurance, I when I go and get glasses at the, you know, the eye doctor, it's still like a hundred plus dollars, which is ridiculous. Whereas on Zimf, you can get a pair of glasses from like $20. It's amazing. And the quality is really, really good. So I, I got the pair, they're called Epurinol and they're these really, really cool black frames. I'll, I'll take them off and show them to you. Black frames. They have a little bit of like a cat eye shape. I love them. They are quite large. So they're a little bit of like a, I'll wear them on the days when I'm wanting to be a little extra. Like today is perfect day for them. When I got the glasses, they came in this box right here. It's a really nice little box. You open it and your glasses are in there. There's also a little cloth for helping you clean your glasses. So I love this. I will keep this little cloth, usually my eyeglasses case in my purse. And it helps to like on the go, take this, wipe off your glasses. It helps clean them really, really quickly. I will say the shipping for this was also super, super quick. I was really, really impressed with how quickly it came. I'm also really impressed with the quality of these. These feel really nice. They feel like something, honestly, you would get from, I don't know, whatever eyeglass place you might go to in person and pay like $120 for. These feel like designer frames. So I'm really impressed with that. Obviously, you know, I also love a good cat eye shape. So this with the black frame on it is perfect for me, but they do have other styles, whether you're wanting metal frames, plastic frames, they have it all. And they have a lot of really fun colors. I actually, once I got these, I was super impressed by them. I actually went and bought a pair of sunglasses and another pair of glasses for myself using my code, which you guys can do as well. I'll leave a link in the description below. So you follow this link and when you get to check out, use the code BASOM, so B-E-S-O-M. It'll give you 50% off frames and 10% off lenses, which is an amazing deal. And you can use this for multiple frames. So if it's you and maybe you got kids that you need to get glasses for, but you're not wanting to spend $120 on glasses for your kids, this is a great option. So definitely check them out. You guys will see me rocking these. And when I get my new pair, I will also be posting some pictures of that on Instagram as well. So I'm sure I'll be wearing them during videos here <laughs> too. But yeah, all this to say, I'm super, super impressed. I love these. Like I said, these are definitely a little bit extra, but I'm not mad at it. I think they're really, really fun. Also, these are blue light filtering. They did have an option to add that and they were kind enough to do that for mine. If you're someone who's on the computer a lot or watches a lot of TV or you're on your phone a lot, blue light filtering is actually really important. It helps prevent you know, as much strain on your eyes as you can. So I got that because 
oh Lord, between being on my phone and editing videos and stuff on here, I'm on the computer a lot. So these are really have been, I've noticed a difference in getting less tension headaches and that sort of thing. So um, when you're getting your glasses, there is an option to add that on. I do highly recommend it, especially again, if you're someone who's at the computer a lot or if you're on your phone a lot. Thank you again to Zimp for sending me these glasses. I really, really love them. I'm super impressed and for giving all of us a code to try and get some more cute glasses at a great price. All right, back to the video. So I think I'm gonna do it in order of the sale. Typically I would do this by type. So like all the clothes go in one area, all the home goods do another area, all the jewelry and accessories do another area, but I think I'm gonna do it by sale just because that's how I have it written in my little notebook and it'll make it a little bit easier for me to make sure I cover everything for you guys. The first sale we're gonna do is the 40% off four clearance items. I got four clearance items and then I got a few other items as well because I was already in need of them. So I figured I'm, I'm making order, might as well do it that way, I'll at least get free shipping out of it. First item I got is the Trust Nobody Scarf. I honestly didn't realize it said Trust Nobody on it when I got it. I don't know if you can kind of see, it says Trust Nobody. But there's also these big, purple spider webs and this like fringy end of it. I honestly got it for the spider webs. I figure I could probably kind of turn it over and just wear it, wear it like this and then, then hold the spider webs out. This is honestly super, super thick. I'm very impressed. I got this for $5.38. Like you can't even get a Walmart scarf for that cheap, my friends. And it definitely wouldn't be this thick. So I'm really, really impressed by this. If there's any clothing items, I will make sure and like, I'm gonna do a little insert a little video of me doing the try on on them. I actually tried most of these on already just to make sure they're okay so I didn't need to like ship them back or exchange it or anything before making the video. I am super excited. So I'll make sure and insert stuff when I get to the clothing items. Next thing, I got two pairs of the Wretched Soul Distress socks. I got uh, an orange and I also got a purple. And these are one size socks. Let me take them out. I, these I actually have not tried on. So I'm really hopeful that they fit. Okay, so the style of the socks, what it is, it's striped socks. They're usually probably, it's gonna be at least knee high for me, if not over knee high, if it will go over my knee. <laughs> Up to my thigh. Oh my gosh, these feel pretty tight. We'll see. I'll insert some footage of me wearing them, hopefully. Um, but they have this stripe detailing and then inside the stripes there's like this mesh panel I don't know if you guys see so it's like a little fishnetty design so it's supposed to kind of make it look like you're wearing fishnets and then like distress socks over them I thought these are really cool I mean I got orange obviously so I can wear them during spooky season and then I got purple because well your ghoul loves some purple purple hair purple life purple decor <laughs> $5.99 for each pair um, I'm really hopeful I like them. I thought they were kind of nice. Like, if anything, I feel like these would be really good to wear under boots. Um, I'm actually going to the Ren Fair tomorrow, and it's Pirates Weekend. So I'm thinking I might wear the purple pair with my, like, knee-high boots. I don't know. That'd be a fun thing. They feel kind of, like, kind of thick, comfortable. So I'm really hopeful these turn out well. The last item I got that was part of the clearance section from this was... This is called the Fade Away Farrah Velvet Dress. And it is this beautiful burnout velvet. I I love velvet. I mean, this is a burnout velvet dress too. It's probably honestly uh, not the same exact print, but it's also a Carol Star dress. Like first of all, bell sleeve, but this burnout velvet detailing. It's absolutely gorgeous. It is um, a bit see through, so I will probably wear like a black tank dress. I'll wear underneath this. This would be great to wear like tank top, some leggings, this and some boots would be a super nice, comfortable outfit, like especially for the fall. And it's not gonna be like super, super thick, but it's fairly weighty. So I think it's gonna add some like, just nice coziness to it. Overall, I'm really impressed with the the quality of the fabric. There are some Killstar stuff, you gotta be careful. Some things aren't as good a quality dollar because I mean, they are fast fashion now, unfortunately. Most of the stuff I got is stuff from like older collections, so that way, it was before they really started to get too cheaply made. But I'm really happy with this one. I think it's really, really lovely. So soft and comfortable. Super excited. That one, I paid $19.79. I think that's originally like a 40 something or 50 something dollar item, which is ridiculous. But you get it under $20, I was pleased with that. Next thing I got, this was, maybe this was part of the clearance too, because it was really, really cheap. 
This was $9.59. It's the Doom Mesh Top. So it's just this like black top. The top of it is this mesh panel. If you gotta see right there. The mesh panel on the top. And then you have at the bottom, there's like these D-ring detailing. I like this. It's nice and lightweight, but really, really comfortable. Like this would be a great, like, again, throw this with some leggings or jeans, some boots or sneakers or whatever. This would be really great for concerts. That's actually one of the reasons why I got it. Cause I was like, hey, this would be like, I could totally layer this, like add it, you know, a sweater or something on top of it. Or if I get too warm, wear just this. So really happy with this again nine dollars 59 cents I'm, I'm not mad at it for a really nice and soft material so super pleased with that one two items i got that were not part of the sale but they had just recently been released on the website and um i dearly had to have them <laughs> and they're both accessories so the first one is the moon bloom necklace this looks gorgeous i honestly got this because they had this and the next item like in the, on the same person at the same time. And I was like, that's a gorgeous combination. I need to replicate it. So here's the necklace. It's this moon necklace, with this gorgeous like filigree. It almost looks kind of like branchy or honestly even like vessels and like roses, this like little, I don't know, glass jewel. And then there's these other roses right there on it. Actually, this is beautiful. It's a nice, it's a longer necklace. So it's definitely one you could layer, like you wear it. It'll probably come down to like mid chest or so. I think it's just so beautiful and so very witchy. I love it. It's also giving me very like vampire vibes and I'm so here for that. That one, it was a $29.99. It was not a cheap piece, but honestly it was so different and interesting to me that it was worth it because a lot of my really nice jewelry, like my nice necklaces that you guys compliment on a lot are all from Killstar. So for me, like these are really, honestly feel like really nice well-made pieces that I, a lot of them I keep for years and they hold up and they're just really, really pretty. So it's worth paying a little extra to me. The last item I got from the first haul is the Mystic Sight Sunglasses. I got these because my other really, really pretty sunglasses that you guys always see me wearing broke they broke right at the little joint of it and i was like oh i need some new sunglasses so i got this pair and i thought they were so so lovely they have a little moon detailing flowers and like the round shape on this this is super like 90s you guys see me wearing these a lot in the most recent hunting videos so this is the ones i've been wearing they're really really comfortable they do have adjustable nose pads so that's really nice. I'm not used to that. I wear plastic glasses a lot. I think these are really nice. These were $24.99, but super, super worth it. I, I love their glasses. Like those other pair, I've had those for at least maybe two years and I just happened to break them, trying to get them out of my purse and, you know, yanked them too hard and they broke. So that was on me. They do come in also, they come with this nice like little sleeve. It says Killstar on it, but I usually keep them in my purse in this because it, even though it's not a hard case, it's still something to protect the glass from getting scratched. All right, so the next sale was the 30% off birthday sale. I got two things from the U.S. store and I don't even know, but a whole bunch of things from the U.K. store. So let's do the U.S. store first. The first item I got is the Lunar Rose Necklace. Let me unpackage this for you. So this necklace is, again, part of the collection from the same one, the other moon one we just saw. But it has just this moon with the roses on the side right there. I really love this, and I feel like also I'd probably, I might actually wear it today. I'll put it on here. It goes to about this length. You can change it. I mean, there is the, like, there is the little lobster claw right there, so you can change the length of it. I really like this. Again, these are metal. This is really, really nice quality. I love the detailing in the center. Again, the kind of in between branches and honestly vessels. I'm not mad at it as a heart gal. <laughs> I, I think it's really, really cool. So really, really pleased with this necklace. I got this necklace for, it was $20.99. So not the cheapest being 30% off, but also better than paying full price. So I'm not mad at it. And again, it's a beautiful, beautiful necklace that will go with a lot of a lot of my stuff. I wear tend to wear a lot of either moons or bats or very witchy stuff. It goes really well with my aesthetic. Second item is the Mythic Mind Kimono. And you guys, when I saw this on the website, I actually waited a good like maybe month or so before buying it because it's kind of expensive, but it also was in my like wish list forever. It is <laughs> this green velvet kimono. But just look at this detailing. It's almost like burnout detailing. It's like little unicorns. It's absolutely gorgeous. And then the edges have this really, really lovely 
black fringe. I mean, this with like a cute pair of leggings and some boots, I think will be really, really nice. And is very, very weighty. Like this is kind of a heavy velvet material. I was very surprised and impressed. I mean, I paid $48.99 which is crazy, but also you guys know how much I love green velvet and just velvet in general. I really love kimonos and this kind of style. So I will wear it and it's worth it because it's, a, it's really, really well made. I'm very impressed. Again, super, super weighty. I think it'll be great for the fall weather. I could wear like a long black sleeve shirt with it and some jeans and boots. And it's, it's just, I don't know. I think it's just like one easy thing to elevate an outfit and it's super, super pretty. Okay, so now let's get into the stuff I got from the UK. It was a big order. I honestly am not mad at it because the two main things were the most expensive items, but these were items I had them eye eye on. And then I know at least one of them sold out on the US site. So I was really, really excited to find it on the UK site because I had been looking even on like Mercari or Poshmark or Depop. I was trying to find it secondhand and everybody was wanting like a hundred dollars for it. I'm sorry, I love it, but not that much. So I was super happy to find it on the UK site. And that item is the Enchanter hooded coat. Oh my goodness, you guys. First of all, this beautiful, really thick, I guess you would say fleecy material, and it zips down, but the hood, <laughs> let me show you. It is like the biggest faux fur edging. Really, really nice big hood on the zip. The pull on it is a really cool pentacle. It's a nice metal material. This also has pockets, which, oh my gosh, I'm super excited for. I will say it's more like a cloak rather than a coat. You'll see in the try on, but it like pulls all the way open. So it's not like completely enclosed, but it's a heavy, heavy material. That I feel like you can layer this. You could totally wear this like on top of sweaters even, and you're gonna stay really nice and warm and really comfortable. So I feel like, again, I've been trying to find more pieces where like I can add them to a really comfortable outfit, but still look somewhat put together. <laughs> and I feel like this will do it. Like I could totally wear this over even just like a sweatshirt and leggings. And I'll, I think I'll look like really like kind of cute and put together. So I'm really happy about this. This item was $55.99, which is crazy. Again, 30% off, but they normally have it at like 80 or 90 something on the website. And again, secondhand was over a hundred dollars. So I, and for something I've been wanting for like probably a couple years. This has been out for a couple of years, which is probably why on the US side it sold out, but they still happen to have it on the UK site. And I was really, really happy about it. The next item is gonna be hard for me to show you. So you're definitely gonna have to see it. So this is the Assassin's Hooded Cardigan. I love this item. I've been contemplating getting it for, again, probably a couple of years, but I was really concerned because it looks very long and I am short. I am like 5'1". So I was concerned it was gonna be too big on me. Um, I actually ended up sizing down on this. I got a medium. I normally wear like extra large in Killstar, sometimes extra, extra large. Um, I am a women's US size 12 to 14, depending on the brand. I got the medium in this because people were saying it ran super, super big. I'm glad I did. It still fits really well though. It has these really, I mean, I'll say for one, massive, massive hood. The sleeves on it are this nice thick material. It does have like a little banded um, cuff, which I really like. That means it'll hold stuff in a little bit better. There are these D-ring accents on the sleeve as well, but it is just really long and it's got like these extra little scarf thingies that you pull over you. You'll see in the try on. I'll try and maybe explain it and show it a little bit better because it's just super, super long, massive. It just looks like a big black blob, I'm sure. It Honestly, I will say this, if you're trying to look like super cinched in and cute, this is not the item for that. This is the item to be warm in, <laughs> but also still look fashionable, I think. It's, it's more of like a baggier style and it has like lots of little layers on it. I really like it. I feel like this over like dress or something with leggings and boots would be really, really cool. Um, Cause it'll keep you warm when you need to be warm and then when you take it off, you know, you have just your dress, but I really like this. Again, I love the massive hood on it and I just love all the little metal detailings. It's really, really nice. This was $55.99. Again, it was the Assassin's Hooded Cardigan. I have, I think, just a couple more clothing items from this one and then the rest are, are home goods. I went a little crazy on the home goods because I was super excited because I don't think any of those are on the American site, so or the US site, so I was really excited to find them. The other top is, this is called the Cora Long Sleeve Top. Honestly, I mean, this is fine. It's just like a thinner black long sleeve shirt, but you'll be able to see on the try on, like the bottoms of it, it has this kind of like, 
I don't know, swooping detail. So like the sides are a little bit longer than the front and the back, which I thought I really liked. I thought it was just very like kind of whimsical. I really like it. I think it is nice. This would be great again for layering. But I just really liked the shape of this. Um, the sleeves, one thing I really liked about the sleeves is they're just regular sleeves. Killstar loves themselves some like bell sleeves, some long, super lazy velvet sleeves, which I think are gorgeous, but they're not very practical. <laughs> so I tend to, I have a couple items like that for like special occasions, but I tend to steer away from those because good lord love the sleeves but they get in the way so I love just a normal just normal sleeve I don't need I love the flutter but it's in my way I can't do anything when I have all the flutter you know I just want the sleeve I'm really happy about this one this one was 1609 which maybe 1609 that's a random number which may be a little bit much for just a black t-shirt but again because of the the detailing and the styling along the edges I think it's worth it next thing I got are the they're called the Amora ankle socks I've been wanting some little socks to wear like with my my spider web boots I got my demonias I don't know if you've if you see my Instagram I, put, I got some spider web boots from demonia for my birthday I love them but I, I don't have a ton of like socks that look good with like boots that are a little bit higher than ankle length. So I thought these would be really fun. They're just these lacy socks, the kind of like ruffly top. They do have a cross. I, I'm not a big fan of crosses. Um, I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. If that's your thing, that's totally cool. I will say it is like a really beautiful cross. It's nice metal. Um, there's like some little black jeweling on each of the points but I probably will take it off just because that's not a symbol I resonate with. But it is very like nice and gothic, so if it is your thing, I think these are really cool. I really like them even without it because it, again, it's kind of hard to find just fun like lacy ruffly socks like this. These were $3.49. And again, if you did find them like Hot Topic or I don't know where else you could maybe find them. Target? Probably not. They're not gonna be cute like this and they're definitely not gonna be $3.49. So it does say this on here, the packaging is in. It says life's too short for lame socks. So I thought that was really cute. This next item, you guys, it may not look the most flattering on me, but it is an item I have been watching at least since 2020, if not 2019. I love this belt. It is so beautiful. Lord, y'all, this video is gonna be like a million hours long. I'm so sorry. Look at this. This is the Cosmic Goddess Waist Belt. Oh, can you even just all the studs, this beautiful moon pool, and like just the shape of this is gorgeous. Only problem, the back is elasticized, which is really nice, but this isn't a one size item. They don't have a plus size one. And although I'm like right at the border of plus size and non plus size, I still got it because I love it. And I'm hopeful maybe I can lose a little bit of weight or from the front, I think it looks stunning on me. I feel like real cinched. It's just on the back, you see a little bit of a bowl, a little bit of a jelly roll going on, which honestly, whatever, is totally fine. But I think I'd probably wear this and then wear like, I don't know, a cardigan or some sort of like sweater over it. So you see this from the front and in the back, you just see the sweater. I'm so happy about this. I get, I've wanted this belt for, <sighs> Honestly, since it came out, I remember when I first saw it, I was like, oh, and I almost bought it then because it's been on sale several times. I was so concerned because people were saying it ran small and I was like, I don't know. I don't know if I want a chance buying it and not work. And then it eventually sold out on the US site and I kind of gave up hope. And then so when I was looking on the UK site at this order and I found it, I was like, beach, it is my time, it is my calling, we're getting this belt. Maybe one day I'll lose a little weight. Until then, I'm still gonna rock it and I'm gonna feel super cute while doing so. Okay, so let's get into a little bit of house decor. I didn't get a ton, but I got some stuff. First thing I got, this is called the Crawly Ice Cube Tray. It has spiders in a spider web style. I love this so much. I'm, I'm, I, I kind of like spiders. We have a decent amount of them in our house, much to Craig's horror. They're usually up in the ceiling and stuff and in the basements. So I don't mind them. They eat all the other tiny bugs and mosquitoes, so whatever. They're not hurting us. I love these because it's really fun way. They're ice cube trays. So you just put water in it, freeze it, and then you can have yourself some spooky spider ice cubes. I'm super excited. If you saw my Target haul, I think last week, um, I found like the skull ice cube tray thing at Target. 
love it. And then so I was like, oh my gosh, this goes with it perfectly. I've had this order honestly for a while. I've been meaning to do this haul for a couple weeks now. Um, but I'm super, super excited. Again, just look at the detailing. I don't know if it'll actually create the like spider web detailing on it or how well the legs will stick together when we when I make them. But I'm really excited to try it out. I thought I'd just make some really cool like spooky drinks. Might honestly put it in my iced coffee in the morning. Just start my day off nice and spooky. Uh, that was really cute. This was $5.59 which is really not bad for something super cute like this. I feel like you're gonna pay more than that at Target for some of their like silicone molds. So I thought, I just thought it was really fun and quirky. Next thing I got, hopefully I can do this without the glare, is these cookie cutters. And you have a ghost, a haunted house, and this like spooky moon. I love these so much. For Vlogoween, you know we have to do at least a couple baking videos. So I thought I would use these and maybe we'll try and make some spooky cookies. Make maybe some sugar cookies. No, honestly, probably chocolate chip. Who are we kidding? We need chocolate in our life. So I'll probably try and use these to make some <laughs> spooky chocolate chip cookies. I'm super excited to see how well they work. These were, again, $5.59 as well. But these were a really cool thing. I don't know, again, if they're on the US website. You'll have to check. These, again, were called the Spooktacular Cookie cutters. I'm trying, I'm hopefully everything, I will have the name across the screen so you guys can go look it on their website if you want, but I'm super excited. The other two things I got were, honestly, I just found them and I was like, hey, these are super cheap. Let's get them. Uh, the first one is the planchette sticky notes. I thought these were super cute. It's just like little post-its. Sorry for the glare. Little post-its with like planchette detailing on it. I just thought it was fun. The other one, you know, I had to get were the cauldron sticky notes. I mean, oh, this is just so happy. I can just imagine. Oh, they have two colors. It's green and white. These do too. These are purple and white. Oh, that's cool. I'm so excited to be making notes, putting little cauldron stickies everywhere in all my notebooks on the calendar. It's going to be so good. I'm so excited. These are each $2.09. I mean, come on. Even post-its are more expensive than that, I think. And they're not cute and spooky. All right, guys, we've made it to the last haul. The last one this is the International Bat Night 30% off total order haul. Super excited for this when I saw they were releasing some bat items. Of course, I had to partake. First one, bat stained glass. It's so, so pretty. And it's just like gray detailing, a little bit of kind of glittery material inside, but it looks really, really lovely. I have a whole window in my dining room that has so many like stained glass sun catchers. So I was really excited when they had a bat one. I will say on the website, it looks much bigger than this. Mm, sorry, my cats are acting up. I will say on the website, it looked much bigger than this, but that just be could be me being like, oh my gosh, bat sun catcher and expecting it to be massive because they didn't have anything else around it for a frame of reference. And I don't think they even listed the size on it. So this is about how big it is in case you're interested in getting it. Um, I do think it's worth it. I really love it, especially if you're a bat lover like me. I think it's a really fun, unique piece. This was $23.09. Still, I, I'm glad I at least got it at 30% off, but I thought it was really, really cool. Next item, ooh, I'm super excited. I'm just not taking this out of packaging. I haven't looked at it yet. Next item is the Release the Bat brooch. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. So this is the Release the Bat brooch. Look at this. First of all, this edging, this detailing is so very like delicate and beautiful, very Victorian. And then you have the bat on it. I mean, yes. And then there's these chains, these little, little pointy bits on the sides. I think this is really, really lovely. I got it because I love bats and I think it looks really cute. If you have like a collar top, put this like right in the center. I think it's gonna be really, really lovely. I actually bought this because um, for Halloween, I'm wanting to do like a little bit of like a nausea kind of cosplay because I love nausea and I feel like this is something she would so rock. So I got this for that, but I will honestly just wear it anytime I'm feeling a little extra batty. This was $17.49, which I don't think is bad for a really nice, feels really nice. So I'm really excited about that. I'm excited about every piece. Can you tell? If I haven't said it already, I'm excited about everything. The next thing is the Dark Minds necklace, which I think I wore the other day. So I don't have it, but I will make sure and put, this was actually the necklace I wore last day of my last Target 
decor hunting video it was that like metal bat with like the little black jewel in the center is really really pretty because it's not it's almost like artsy bat it doesn't look necessarily like there's no bat face on it but it's the shape of the bat I feel like it's a really like kind of more dressy way to wear bats so I'm really excited to have that again I kind of got that to go with the brooch for my Nadia outfit like layer the two obviously I will wear it pretty much any day of the week as well because it's really really beautiful and I think for like if you had like a fancier outfit or like a nicer event you're going to that would be a cute way to add like some bad energy into it but still look like dressy so really excited for that one that one was one of the more expensive is $20.99 but honestly it's so so nice it, it, it was metal as well so really excited about that one all right next to the last item guys I promise we're almost there this is the cast spells brew cup and I thought this is cute. I, I have one of their other ones. I have the ones that says like, I myself am strange and unusual, but it's this really lovely detailing. Look, Oliver hanging out, having a good time. Our little bat. And it says, it's just a bunch of hocus pocus. It's really beautiful detailing on it. They happen to have forgot my straw, but I have so many extra ones because I have a bunch of these cold cups. So I'll just use one from a different one. It wasn't worth contacting customer service because they'd probably be like send it back for a return or blah blah, blah. I, it's not worth all that effort when I can just put a different straw into it um but I just thought I mentioned it otherwise I'm really really happy with this the again the other one I have I've had for a couple years it's it's lasted very very well too and this was $11.19 I mean and this is like basically like venti size if you're looking for an equivalent Starbucks size this usually holds about that much the last the final item is what I'm wearing. This witch brim hat. You guys, I have wanted one of their hats for a while, but I have a really small head. And so I was very concerned about it not fitting. And I was right to have that concern. When I first got this, this thing was just like, just like toppling all over. It would not stay on my head. So, ooh, hat hair. I did have to put some stuff on the inside. So all I did was I put like this like foam layering. It's the stuff you would put like around windows and doors for like extra insulation. I got it on Amazon. It's just like half inch thick, half inch wide. Put that right on the inside. And for me, this fits so well now. Like I love it. And it's so cute. This really nice, thick kind of, kind of wooly, but it's not wool material. And then it's really, really lovely, simple, but cute ribbon around the edging right there. I think it's cool and like you can have it like I think when I got it it was originally like pushed in like this but I don't I want to wear them usually a little bit deeper on my head so I pushed it back out to people honestly I like the little bit more round it gives me a little bit more Salem vibe I love this I'm so excited because I do have another black hat but it's like a little bit more floppy around the edges it's not like as stiff this and this came I was really surprised it was still really well in shape very nice and stiff. So super excited for this. This is $27.99. This was not part of like the bat section, but because I had got stuff in the bat section, I got this 30% off, which super excited for that. I'm really happy. I'm really, really pleased. I feel like if you have a bigger head, you're going to be absolutely fine with this. It's going to fit great. I don't think anybody, unless you have like a really, really big head, I don't think anybody has said much about it being, you know, too small. But if you have a smaller head like me, you can just get, you know, that little insulation, put it right inside the, the brim and then you can rock yourself a cute hat. I'm so pleased. I love it. That is the full haul. Thank you guys for watching this. I know it was a lot, um, but I had to share all of the good things with you guys. So it's stuff you can keep your eye out on if you're also interested in it. They do sales a lot. Honestly, it seems like almost every weekend or every other weekend, they're doing some sort of sale. So that way you can make your list, keep an eye on it, buy stuff only when it's on sale. Definitely check the clearance section when they have that extra clearance deal. Get that as well because that's the only way to make it, have a good deal on this. I love Killstar stuff, but it can be a little bit overpriced. Trying to get it when it's on sale or like super sale is the way to go. Thank you guys so much for watching. I also want to give a huge thanks to Zim for sending me these glasses and for giving you guys a discount code. Remember, go to the link in the description. Once you get to checkout, make sure you use the code BASOM, B-E-S-O-M. You'll get 50% off frames, 10% off lenses. You definitely want to give it a look because honestly, you're not going to find a better deal, especially with that discount code. And if you're trying to get, I got, again, a pair of sunglasses, their prescription, and I got another pair of reading glasses. Like, 
it's a great deal and totally worth it. Two pairs of glasses for me, I think. With all the other fancy add-ons I did, I think it was like $70 and I got free shipping. So for two pairs of glasses, I'm not mad. And they're like cute styles. Not some like, no offense to Walmart, but you can get some, some cheap stuff there, but you're usually kind of just plain Jane. These are, these got some style. These have some personality. So definitely check that out. If you guys enjoyed this video, please do give me a big old thumbs up. Also, if you haven't already, consider subscribing to the channel and make sure you hit the bell so you're notified every single time I upload. I do usually try to do at least two videos a week when my body and <laughs> chronic illness, rheumatoid, fibro, heart stuff all cooperate. I give you two videos. So you definitely don't want to miss out. I do also have a Patreon if you guys are interested in supporting the channel further. Link is in the description below so you can see all the tiers and the different goodies you get for each tier. I would love to have your extra support. But thank you guys again so much for all your love. I really do appreciate it. I hope you're doing wonderful and I will see you in the next video. Bye! By the way, I mean, ghoul's makeup is looking cute! <laughs>